Let's have a quick look at the oil and the US and Australian dollar. Let's get straight into it. Do not place a trade based on what you're seeing in this video today because trading is risky and it can cause substantial financial loss. There are so many areas you need to become good at to become a good trader. Emotional mastery, chart reading, trading systems, money and trade management. So this video is just educational only to help you become a much better trader. Hey traders, I've just recorded the video showing you the most powerful chart reading technique that has worked ever since the market started. As you know, but learning how to read the charts is very important to your trading success. So click on the box above that says PT method to get access now. All right, so looking at oil, uh, let me just, uh, you can see on oil on the shorts, the last quarter of a couple of months, we've been slowly stair stepping up, big up bar through here, and we're continuing to slowly stair step up now, looking at oil. Uh, you can see just a nice rise. We are sort of flattening out through here right now. What's that all about? If you have a look at, this is the weekly chart here. There we go. So this is the weekly chart here on oil. And you can see that there's, there's actually a few things that's actually happening here uh, on oil. Let me actually bring this up here. So let me just uh, delete. Actually, we'll start from this low here. All right, so let's start from that point through there. Let me just delete that. Uh, let me just create a, create a parallel trend line through there. All right, so somewhere around about there. Um, you know, what, let's not even do that through there. But you can see right now what's happening with oil. Oil has really broken above this 50 level, and now it's trying to come down to test this as support. So do we hold this as support and rally back up and out? Uh, I I actually think we will, and I think we're likely to start to go to 60 and then back up to um, back up to the 70 or back up to the set back up to 70 mark so looking at that there if we go and have a look at like uh uh the uso which is the uh oil fund one thing i'm looking at with uh, uso if i go to go to the weekly chart this is one that i'm actually looking to trade if you can see you can see basically this whole area through here which is that 12 basically 12 level is still acting as uh, acting as acting as resistance but noticing guys notice this here is that notice how we're starting to get some nice rising out of this that simply means if i bring up an arrow you're starting to see that we are starting to rise up more we're starting to you can see the buyers are holding it up holding it up it's they're keeping it up a little bit more so if we have a if we if we hold it here and the next couple of weeks, we have a nice little breakout, creating a nice little high trough. That's a very, very powerful move, guys. And we got a big explosion move coming, um, you know, in this USA. And we're likely to rise. We're likely to rally back up there, which to me is what is that? That's like a thirty percent increase, a thirty percent move coming in USO. And and you can see that there. So guys, I'm, I'm basically giving you guys this setup. If we hold here, okay. If we do hold here, right now, like right here. Let me see if I can just change that color. Uh, basically, yeah, basically if we do hold here on a weekly chart, this is going to create a nice little high trough. And then if we do get a, a nicely breakout, again, the breakout for me needs to be above that, especially just needs to be a nice close, weekly close above that $12 level. If that is the case, then we could start to see some movement to the high side. Looking on the daily chart, this is the thing I'm looking for. You see it's a lot messier on the daily chart. Go back to the weekly chart here, and we're starting to see this is what this is what the USO. So as you can see, guys, this is really really smooth. This is like a bit of a gift to you guys. If we if these sort of things happen, this is a really high probability of having a pretty big uh, thirty percent move you know, on USO really really quickly. So that's what I'm looking for there on USO. Uh, UNG, uh, as you guys know, with my UNG trade, uh, that hasn't that hasn't played out. We've had a big gap here. That hasn't played out yet. Let me just delete that off the screen there. Uh, we basically we are in this overall sort of upward sort of channel through here, through there, um, you know, and uh, and we have this overall level of support as well to round through here. So we're at this level of support around here. This again, this is on the weekly chart, major support level. We do have this big gap here to fill, and every single one of these gaps generally do get filled. So I actually, as you guys know, I'm still in my, uh, I'm still in my call options through here. I was doing well, then then, then it got hammered, 
So do we, does the market end up coming up and fill this gap? I do, I do think, I think that will. I still got about three or four months worth of time on my option. So let's see if, if the market does rally and come back up and fill the gap, then I'll be in small profit and, and, uh, and uh, I'll, I'll be able to get out with that. But that's, you know, you guys that saw my UNG trade, that's my UNG update through there. Uh, God damn it, I don't know idea why, but that's basically what happened at the start of the year. Let's go have a look at uh, a few things here. Let's go have a look at the UUP. So the, the US dollar. Uh, we, let's go have a look at the weekly chart here. So weekly chart. Weekly chart, we have this overall area of, of support and resistance. Um, we, and we're at that level of support and resistance. We are still stair-stepping higher. So nice bull trend. Nothing has really changed here yet on US dollar. So we continue to rise up really, really nice as this has been pulling back. This whole area through here is indeed the support and resistance level. So nothing's really changed when it comes to US dollar and the uh, uh, the uh, uh, the Australian dollar. Australian dollar uh, continued to rise down as you can see clear 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 bearish uh, clear bearish uh, movement through here both the 52 is below the 200 we are stair stepping down we're getting basically we're getting basically this major little high trough a low peak low peak lower trough lower trough so major overall stair stepping down weekly chart uh, very very weak as well too so uh, um, the US dollar looks really really weak for now guys okay for now um, the thing about trading is that this this could easily flip and start to rally back up and start to now turn back into a bullish scenario. That's where we need to be very, very, you need to be very flexible with your own trading in the market. Hey, thanks for watching. If you'd like to get more free education about trading, then click on the box that says free trading course. This is a free trading course. It goes for around 12 hours long. It's about 12 videos long. It covers everything from chart reading, mindset, trading systems, money management, trade management, everything you need to get yourself ahead in the markets. And if you'd like to get my help personally, then click on the box that says get John's help and you'll be able to see how you can get my help personally. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on the video. And remember, success can be yours if you go claim it. So step up, take massive action, and face your fears today.